Hey, Richard. Hey, Kevin. So you've obviously gotten the email from Stacy in North Carolina. I did. She writes that she walked into the home center and she sees a plastic water heater. First time she's ever seen That's that. Right. And it had a lifetime warranty. Right. And now she's thinking, like, is this her next water heater? Well, you know, and I had never installed one of these. They've been out for a little while, so I went out to the home center. This is a 50-gallon tank. It was about 1200 bucks. Mm, that's so a lot, right? So two to three times more than a conventional uh, glass line steel tank. That's something. Okay, it's a plastic tank. There's a warranty for the lifetime on the tank itself. It's got more insulation, two inches of insulation right here. So, but the tank has often been the issue why water heaters fail. Here's the inside of what we've always used. This is the standard tank in America. This is a glass lined steel tank. Now, this right. happens to be gas fired but the electric would have an element that sticks in right here. Mm -hmm. Now, when you have water, you're gonna have the chance for corrosion and electrolysis. It wants to eat anything that's ferrous, anything that's metal. Right. Now, the way to get around that electrolysis has always been to put an anode rod. This is a sacrificial rod that sits down inside the tank yep. made out of manganese or aluminum, very ignoble metal so it can take all the electrolysis here. This is what it should look like. <laughs> This is what it ends up looking like. And once that fails, it's going to make the tank leak. And, and that's why the warranty on these old tanks is what? Five or six years, seven You're years? You're lucky to get five, six, seven years. Sometimes the warranty is five, sometimes it's ten. You're of the mindset that that's going to fail no matter what you do Absolutely. eventually. Absolutely. They're almost planned to fail. So are you suggesting that you know because of that comparison, this is the way to go? I don't know that for sure yet. I mean, it depends on what decision filter you want to apply. Right. If it was on efficiency only, I was really surprised that the electrical efficiency is not that much a savings. This is about five or ten percent better than this one. I thought it would have been a little bit more. It took a long time to right. make that up when right. you pay twelve hundred bucks right. up front. Then the warranty is only on the tank. It's not on the parts. So inside this tank, to heat the water, it has two of these. What is this made out of? This electric element. Steel. It's made out of steel. So now that's going to sit inside the water. So it means that someday short of a lifetime, these elements are going to have to be changed. So that means you're not, it means if you have a tank like this, you're going to have to see a plumber someday to change the elements and, and replace them. You won't have to change an anode, but you will have to do those. And then the final question is how long you stay in the house. If you pay three times more, will you stay in long enough to enjoy it? So it all comes down to what she wants to buy. That's right. All right, but th that's good information to have so she can make that decision. That's right. All right, thank you. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project. So be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.